Valley Water is investing in technology that will help us to manage an increase in food waste sent to landfill as Melbourne's population grows. We're building a waste to energy facility at our existing Lilydale sewage treatment plant, which has been operating in Nelson Road for more than 50 years. This will be Yarra Valley Water's second waste to energy facility, following on from our first one at Wallard in Melbourne's North, which has been operating since 2017. We'll be using a natural process to transform food scraps into clean, green energy. In addition to reducing landfill and slashing greenhouse gas emissions, generating renewable energy on site will help us to avoid energy bills for our facilities, keeping pressure off our customers' water bills. The energy we generate will power the facility itself and our sewage treatment plant. Additional energy will be exported to the power grid. It'll make recycling food waste easier and more affordable for local businesses in the Yarra Ranges and the surrounding areas. The facility will typically process 150 tonnes of commercial food waste each day or 50,000 tonnes of food waste each year. The facility will create around 33,000 kilowatt hours of electricity each day, which is about 30% of Yarra Valley Water's total energy requirements. We're in the early stages of developing the project in Lilydale, and now is the time for you to help shape the look of the facility and how it operates before we finalise our design and start building. We will build through 2022 and the facility should begin accepting waste from suppliers from 2023. You can have your say by leaving a comment online or sign up to participate in a live video discussion with our project team. At a later stage of the project, we'll begin working together with the people of Lilydale and Coldstream to identify ways for the new facility to be providing additional community benefits to the area, such as enhancing the open space around the facility.